In the shadowy corners of the internet, a digital mystery unfolds. Chris Gentoo, the enigmatic force behind Lernix TV, has vanished without a trace, his once active channel now eerily silent for over two weeks. Whispers of his demise echo through the online underworld, but the truth is far more chilling. Sources confirm he's alive, but trapped in a labyrinth far more dangerous than any virtual reality. He's caught in the matrix of his own making. Extract- All right, you ungrateful bastards. If you haven't noticed, which a lot of you have, evidently, right? I've been off the saddle for quite a while. So here's my little chin wag. Due to these oftentimes spasmodic, stressful, and time-consuming facets of living as a fleshy human being, I haven't been able to provide content at the usual pace. And you know what? I think that's okay because I have my own life. Oh, but of course, how could I forget Linux lingo? The aspects of Linux that are very commonly discussed and used in passing, but then you ask what the hell a window manager is and you get told to go fucking explode in the nearest neutron star, you pitiful ball of dirt. And of course, that's quite rude to the newbies, the target audience of this channel. And if you didn't realize it already, you know, since I'm talking to the litany of subscribers that are very pretty overqualified for this shit, what do you guys see in me? The basics constitute as the most brain-dead Linux ideas to gain a grasp on, applicable to even the smallest single-celled organisms. Such a designation includes these items. Distro, package, dependency, repository, package manager, the terminal, window manager, and desktop environment. That is so hard to say. Alright, uh, you know, get yourself prepped for the lightning round because there's a lot of ground to cover here. Short for distribution, a distro is a unique operating system using the Linux kernel. Every distribution differs by philosophy, package manager, prepackaged software, utilities, and more. Popular distros are Linux Mint, Ubuntu, and Arch Linux. A package is a collection of files that make up a piece of software, whether it be a library used for many other applications, a program, a game, or a new command for your terminal. They are the equivalent to installers on Windows, except installing a package usually takes one command. A dependency is any piece of software that is required by another piece of software in order to function correctly. For example, a dependency required in order to install Minecraft on Linux is the Java runtime environment. A repository is a categorical collection of software contained in packages. Repositories or repos for short are utilized by package managers and come in many variations. There are official repos usually native to a specific distribution or there are third-party repos that may contain software not found on official repos. A package manager is a program designed to install, uninstall, and update your packages, resolve dependencies, and search for packages. Every package manager offers a unique approach to doing these things. Most distributions offer their own package manager, but they can be mixed between distributions and can usually be installed outside of their native distro. The terminal is a program that directly interacts with your system via commands. These commands can open programs, interact with utilities like your system clock or your package manager, and can effectively be used to manage your entire system. A window manager is a piece of software responsible for the creation and manipulation of graphical windows used for interacting with programs. It is an essential component of desktop environments that can be used on its own or provide a snappy and minimal desktop experience if you so choose. A DE for short is a suite of software designed to give the user a cohesive desktop experience. This software includes things like taskbars, panels, themes, widgets, and more. Every DE has its own approach to workflow and design philosophy. 